Alfred Taubman's very well known as a pioneer of the shopping mall, but what's less known about him is that he was one of the great collectors of the second half of the 20th century. We're bringing together here at Sotheby's some 500 works, which, while they were hung, were separated over four different homes. This is the first time we've ever been able to experience the collection as a whole. This is the greatest single collection ever to have been offered at auction at one time, and we wanted to mark that sense of history by creating an exhibition devoting our entire building to the Taubman collection, so you can see all of the works together. You know, what's interesting about Taubman is it really is a very personal collection. This is someone who collected over many years. He clearly had um, a love of art, and he collected these things because he liked them. And this is always something that's nice to see, that not only are the paintings beautiful and notable, but they're very, um, they're personal. They're an eclectic collection of things that you can really see one person has put together. And the way that he lived with these works was not as if it were a museum, but these were very intimate parts of his family life. So he would happily hang a Miro next to a Duggar, next to an old master picture. And we've tried to recreate that intimacy and the personal nature of the collection in the way that we've presented our exhibition at Sotheby's. We estimate that the 500 works in the collection will sell for somewhere in excess of $500 million, which would make this sale the most valuable ever sold at auction. You know, I think what it says is that the art market continues to be very healthy, incredibly strong, and that the people who can afford to buy these paintings, some of these estimates are 25 million, 30 million, um, are very wealthy individuals. Many of them are investors, and they look to these paintings and these works of art really as places where they can put their money, put their investments uh, in a relatively secure market, and they're getting very good returns on them.